Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm so excited because I'm going to be doing my first ever Amazon haul and I cannot wait to show you guys what I've got. I've actually never purchased any like clothes off of Amazon. I think I've done like shoes before and maybe some accessories but never clothes so I can't wait to see how they fit, the quality, the style, and all of that. And I'm going to link everything in the description box for you guys if you want to check it out. So let's go ahead and get on into it. So I don't even know where I should start but I think I'm going to do... Let's do some accessories because accessories are always fun. So I saw this hat online. It is just a basic black kind of, I don't know what these are called, but like just a straight flat brimmed hat. It's not floppy at all. I really like it. It's um, very sleek and classy and I think this would go well with a lot of different outfits, especially that black and white shirt back there. I think that's very classy and cute to go together. I wish it was a little bit more wide brimmed. It's kind of small, but it's not bad. I think people with small heads and even my like medium size head, it looks okay. It doesn't look bad. I wish it was just a little bit wider. Like that hat back there is really wide. So I wanted something like in between. So the next hat I got is from this brand right here. And I've been seeing this a lot lately. I actually just walked into anthropology yesterday and saw that they were doing these beanies with a little fluff ball on top. But the cool part is you can change out the color of the fluff ball. And so like there's a little button right there and a button right here. And then you just clip it on. And I love that because you can change up the whole look in a jiffy. Like, I just got the basic black hat because I don't have a black beanie. Um, but yeah, I think that was so cute and fun. They have like bright pink ones, blue ones. They have so many different colors so you guys can check them out and just totally change up the look with a different little color fluff. And this feels so soft. I was telling Kyle this feels like a real foxtail and he's like, have you ever felt one? I'm like, I think so. I think I felt one, but it's so, so soft. So the next thing that I got, Kyle saw this come in and he was like, wait, did you get me one of those? And I was like, no, I'm sorry, but I should get him one because it's very, what is it called? Gender neutral? It is a Carhartt beanie and I think these are so cute. I've been seeing a lot of girls wear them and I loved this kind of seafoam green color. I showed you guys another beanie like this in the past and I don't know how I feel about this like up here just because my head is kind of like wide and then it goes really slim. So I don't know how I feel about this but I love the color and I think I can try to style it and rock it, but they have so many different colors. And this is a great gift idea, even for the guys in your life. Okay, so the next accessory that I got, I'm not really sure about, but I saw Zoella, um, Zoe Sugg, wear these glasses. And hers were from Ray-Ban, but this is the brand that I got them from. They actually look super similar to Ray-Ban. I don't know if they were trying to copy them or not, but it's called Pro Acne. That is what the brand looks like. And I saw these on her, and they just... She just is like the ultimate fall girl, like fall, Christmas. If you want to get in the fall Christmassy spirit, watch Zoe Suggs vlogs. She's just so cute. And she was wearing these glasses. And I would normally never buy these glasses because they remind me of Harry Potter. But for some reason, she just looked so, so stinking cute in them. Of course, they were Ray-Bans. These are not Ray-Bans. But they are just gold circle glasses. And I feel like a total dork in them. But why, why could she pull these off so much better than me? I mean, they're not terrible. Actually, maybe I kind of like them. I don't know. I don't know what Kyle would say about these. He might say I look like Harry Potter. <laughs> um, but they're really nice quality. I feel like they're very firm. Like when you close them, they're not wobbly at all. I mean... They kind of make sounds when you crunch them up, but I mean, I think these were super cheap. So, hmm, maybe with like the right outfit, these would look good. I really, really like them. Just some gold frames. My mom said she didn't like these, <laughs> but I'm gonna try them out, see how I feel about them. Okay, so the next thing that I got are some beautiful nude shoes, and these are from the brand Fry. Fry is a super kind of pricey brand, but I don't think these were like, way out of, I don't think these were like hundreds of dollars. They might have been a hundred dollars. So I'll make sure to have the link in the description box below. But I love these so much. It's like a nude suede material and then nude laces and kind of a light 
brown bottom. I love the light brown bottom because I have bottoms that are white and they get so dirty all the time. So I feel like this would cover a lot of the dirt. So let me know what you guys think about them in the comments down below. I love the brand Fry, but they are just so expensive. So when I saw these, I think they're around 100. I might be totally wrong. I'll leave it right here. But yeah, I think these are beautiful. I hope you guys like them. I know they're more on the pricey side, but I think it's worth buying quality shoes that will last a long time. So I'm super excited about these. So moving on to clothing. I love this leopard print shirt. This is from the brand Blooming Jelly and I got a size medium. It's just a basic nude tee with leopard print on it and you guys know how much I love leopard print so I think this would be so cute with some ripped jeans and even my nude shoes that I just got. Oh, love this so much. You could even pair like a hat with it. I think this is such a basic cute shirt to add to your collection and it seems like really good quality as well. So my camera just ran out of room so sorry if it looks a little bit different now that I changed it up. I was saying lately I've been feeling like even leggings have been too tight and clingy on me so I've been loving wearing joggers lately. So I found these joggers. They are from the brand The Drop and they're just like a light green basic jogger. I think I got them in a size medium. Ooh, it says it's made in Peru. That's cool. And they have a nude tie on them, which I really, really like. It's just this light green kind of forest color with some pockets, and then they are tight on the bottom like regular joggers. So I looked at their holiday gift guide on Amazon, and they have a lot of great ideas on clothing, and they showed me a ton of sweaters. So that's always a good resource if you're looking to buy something for someone or for yourself, and it's a lot of top-rated items items as well. So I got this basic black sweater. It's a turtleneck sweater and I really really love how long it is. I've been wanting a basic black sweater for a long time that you can just pair with jeans or black denim and it looks just very classy and put together and you don't have to do a whole lot or match things. It's just very nice and sleek. This feels like pretty good quality. I wouldn't say it's like amazing quality, but it definitely doesn't feel cheap. So I'm excited to try this on and see how it fits. So the next sweater I got is by Lenny Zinn. I think that's how you pronounce it. And I'm already not loving the color. I think it's a little bit more yellowy than I like my sweaters to be. It almost kind of looks old. Um, it actually doesn't look as yellow on camera as it does in real life. It's pretty yellow. And then it just looks kind of bunched up. And not cute almost like a old man sweater we're gonna see how it looks on but I'm not really impressed with this one the quality is not that good I mean okay the quality is not bad it's not like paper thin but it's not great so I don't think I'd recommend this one and I'm not very excited to try it on I think it looked cuter online okay so I think this one looked a little bit cuter online too but it's not bad not bad at all I love the colors definitely very fall colors and again it's that waffly material and it fits, it's a good medium knit it's not too heavy not too light and I think this will be really cute for fall tucked into a pair of jeans or something like that all right so this one I'm excited to see because they like sealed this one to they like suctioned it I would say this is more of a light knit sweater and it's very very cute I think it's going to be long as well so it will kind of cover my bootay, which I like because I'm tall. A lot of you guys were asking me how tall I am and I say I'm 5'10 and a half, but I haven't been to the doctor in a very long time, so I might be 5'11 now. I'm not really sure. <laughs> the top I got is, is actually kind of out of my comfort zone. I normally don't get any tops with sayings written on them, but for some reason this one was kind of calling my name. I think it says Say La Vie Paris on it, and it's just kind of like a cheap t-shirt. It's nothing like super fancy. It kind of feels a little cheap, um, but I like the yellow and I like the white. I really don't own a lot of yellow things, so just a little pop of yellow I like. Um, and yeah, I think this is just a great little basic tee, and it doesn't feel too cheap. It's more of just like a Forever 21 shirt, if you guys know what I mean. So the next two tops I got are the same. I just got two different colors, and this is the beige one. This is the green one obviously. And they are just long sleeve basic tees. I like having long sleeve basic tees for the winter. You can throw them on with jackets, cardigans, or so on. So I think these will be cute and they feel like pretty good material. I love the beige one that will go cute with my nude shoes. And then 
this green top as well. It's very cute. And I just love the little simple twist in the front. So I'm always a little weary of buying jeans online. And I saw these jeans and they had pretty good ratings. And I also loved that they had a bell bottom kind of style because I think these look so cute with boots. I honestly really love that dark denim color. They're super pretty. And so this is by the brand Vibrant and they're very, very high-waisted and they just made the girl's shape and figure look so cute. So I'm excited to try these on and see how they fit. Hopefully they're not too short. I don't think they will because they look pretty long to me. So very cinched in at the waist and then this is what the booty looks like. Love that denim color. It's super dark, super pretty. I just love a sleek, nice pair of jeans. So that is everything that I got. I wanted to show you my top two things that I love the most out of this haul. And it has to be this leopard print t-shirt. I thought this was so cute. So I'm so excited that I decided to get it. There is a lot of different styles of this t-shirt as well that you guys can check out. And then of course, my nude shoes. These are just some of my favorite items that I got. I currently haven't tried any of these clothes on like you guys have seen in the video. So I hope you guys really love this Amazon haul. It was so much fun doing. I was a little nervous because picking out clothes online is kind of hard for me. But I love when clothes have reviews and I feel like that really, really helped picking out these items. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Everything will be linked in the description box below. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!